Good morning, everybody. This is Driven Hard. My name is Emeka. If you're brand new to the channel, nice to meet you. All right, so today we got my Range Rover Sport and we are gonna be getting some work done to it. If you remember from, oh, I do it on a few videos, not all the time. Oh, look out, look out. But uh, we got some scuff marks down on the bumper here. If I can just uh, get my out of shape butt down here. We got some scuff marks that we are going to have come um, buffed out, fixed up. Take a look at that there, right? And really, it's all along the bottom. Um, you know, because this thing gets pulled off every now and then. And then we have right down there as well so i got a mobile team coming here they're going to do all of it right here in the um on the driveway so it'll be kind of cool to see um how that process is done um and you know more importantly how it's going to blend in with the rest of the truck because next week i'm taking it to my friends well it's a detailing shop and it's getting full paint corrected and ceramic coated finally because it's well overdue I hate looking at this thing in the Sun I can even see it right there on the front bumper all the I don't know what do you call them pinstripes or whatnot from off-roading I don't know if it's showing up on the camera but can you guys see that I don't know if it's gonna show up on the camera there but all the get my shadow out of the way I don't know who knows but uh, we're gonna get that removed so first we had to get that taken care of so that's gonna be taken care of um, I don't know how much of the footage I'm gonna be showing um, just do because they didn't really want me to do a ton of filming because industry secrets or whatever but um, I'm super pumped for it so they should be arriving any minute and I'm just gonna do a quick inspection to see if there's any other paint chips or things that need to get fixed up that they're gonna do I know I'm gonna have them do this if you can see that they're going to where is it right there I don't know if it's showing up can you guys see that on the screen there so that's a little rock chip we'll get that fixed up and I don't know if there's really anything else that needs actual paint work because the shop I'm going to next work doesn't do paint work or oh, down here so I'll see if I can get them to right because a rock a rock hit that you know what i'll clip in where i did that and i did the first one that looks like oh, that's just blue paint who knows what that's from should be a buff oh, look at these right? horrible absolutely horrible jeez i cannot have nice things but anyways so it's gonna be cool to finally have all that taken care of but um, yeah so anyways so that's the before I'm gonna show you the after but um, this is gonna be a whole process so you're gonna see that and then we're gonna go over to Langley to um, why can't I think of the name of the shop right now Empire graphics I think that's what it is and we're gonna do the full paint correction and ceramic coating so uh, hopefully I can get some of that on film because that'll be kind of a cool process as well but like look at these on the pillars Woo. I don't know can you guys see that it's all right how is that showing up how, how bad that is no, oh yeah there you go look at that look how bad that is right we're gonna get all of that fixed up and then there's a company I've actually ordered I've ordered because you can see all the scratches on the infotainment, right? Some of that's dust. Some of that's, no, but you can see that, right? And there's a couple scratches on here and I've actually got something coming that is going to completely remove those and make it look better than new. So I'm super stoked to bring you that um, video um, when it arrives, it's being uh, sent over to me right now. But uh, all right, let's take a look at some of the finished work. All right guys, so the work is done. I want you to come check this out. And uh, you know, it's still, it still needs to fully dry heal and, um, but 
definitely, definitely happy. Right? Remember that was all marked up. Definitely happy with, with the work and then this is this was the, the really bad side, so but pretty, pretty, pretty solid. So happy with that so far. Um it's gonna look even better tomorrow morning once it fully dries and everything. And uh and then next week we're gonna head over to Langley um and then get it paint corrected, polished up, ceramic coated. <laughs> get the freaking PPF off the hood. This horrible thing that has just been driving me absolutely nuts since I've had it. I hate PPF on four by fours, but uh, excited to get that done. And then this thing is gonna look good as new as long as you don't look at the rims. So the rims are the next thing. I gotta go talk to my rim shop. The same guys who did them on Monterey, Ally Wheel Repair something, they have shops here. So I gotta talk to them and see um, maybe it's just cosmetic work. It is just cosmetic work um, that they can just fix that for me uh, without having to do the entire process that they did. So, but anyways, let's over to Langley and uh, get started on the next process. All right, I am in Langley. I am at Empire Graphics. And uh, if you can see see that behind me, let's see if that, that zooms in, Empire Graphics. And she is done, look at her. Oh my God, this is freaking awesome. So what we've done is a full paint correction, full paint correction, um, ceramic coated. She is looking good. We removed that, that horrible PPF that I had up here. Remember the front kind of looked all bad, but oh, that is looking clear and clean. Could not be happier with this job. He said it was definitely, it definitely needed some serious work. Look at that, and we got the badging fixed as well. Hopefully, hopefully that's showing up there. So this new badging I bought from UK Pro Powerful, UK Powerful online. I'll link them. They got a pretty sweet Land Rover channel. I'm sure you guys are all familiar with that as well. But anyways, super stoked about this. Man, she just looks so good. So good. I gotta do the, I gotta fix up the rims because they are still in rough shape. Um, well, because they're in rough shape because of me, you know, because it's driven hard. But man, I am really, really happy with this job. Paul and his team did an absolutely amazing job. Definitely, uh, I'll link, I'll put their, his Instagram or whatever in the description so you can check it out. But um, I'm gonna go blast around town for a little bit, have some fun, grab me a Slurpee. And um, I don't know, it's gonna be a little late, so I don't know if I can go hit some trails. <laughs> Wouldn't that be funny if it doesn't even last a day? But um, anyways, man, we were just talking about some upcoming rallies that uh, might look into doing, but oh my God, look at her. Look at her. She looks as good as new again. Like. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Look at that, huh? All right, guys. Well, I'm going to get in there, take off from here. But uh, hope you enjoyed the kind of, I don't want to say transformation, but, you know, a little fix up from the bumper to getting the full paint correction, ceramic coated. Can't wait to do the first wash. I'm going to have to go pick up some new supplies because there's no more. Just use, you know, going to a wash bay. I've been, I've been using the brooms of the wash bay. <laughs> Don't tell anybody that. But no more of that for sure, because uh, we got to take care of her for a little bit. Um, I just want to go off riding though. Go off riding. Anyways, whatever I do, you will be the first to know. And until next time, everyone. I'm Omeka. That's the Driven Hard Range Rover. Let me know in the comments what you are driving hard.